Hello everyone and welcome to a new video. Today I'm gonna show you guys how to craft the chef uh, earring um, and uh, do some aptitude crates from the cooking uh, department. Now I have equipped all of my uh, cooking trophies as you can see, uh, they are right here. There I have two majors and one basic. Right. And that's pretty much it. Now, uh, we do need a, uh, what we call a chef's charm, the cooking mastery. And if you look at it, it can be used when crafting earrings. So it even tells us where to use it. So we're just gonna hide uh, the amulets, the rings, and we're gonna go to the earrings here. Uh, probably oh, not here. Okay, there we are. So I want to make the aquamarine earring. This one. So I need a hook and a setting. So let's get a hook. For this, you require some silver ingots and a setting. Uh, as you can see, nine silver ingots. It's all eight. All right, and then we can go to the aquamarine, and we can select the chef charm, and also one more silver ingot. So in total, it will be ten silver ingots. That will cost you and a cut brilliant gem now it doesn't matter which one you can even use the pearl one if you have having brilliant pearls we're gonna select it use the azot and craft it and there you go cooking mastery pretty much all we need there's nothing else I'm gonna equip this there we go. And now we're gonna go to the... Wait, this is not a tier 5 anymore. This is a tier 4 now. Hmm. Does it matter? I hope not. Wait. 675? Wasn't this supposed to be more? Let me just, let me just, you know, like, the small little check here. You can buy more experience if it's, wasn't it 840? Or that was on the Arcana stuff and I'm just losing my mind. Probably losing my mind. Hmm, let's uh, check it out. So, oh, I should have ported you know, to the house, it's right near them. I do have a full uh, chef set, and I am, uh, well, where is it? There we go. Is it more experience? No? Well, okay, let's go back to... <laughs> well, that was, that was an interesting development. Alright, um, let's just use Azot. So, I saw that uh, I had a bunch of stuff in my storage, and I was like, hmm, I can do shit with this. <laughs> they are, aren't worth a penny, literally, they're 0 0.20 uh, piece, and, well, what should I do with it, right? And I found the answer, and that is just, you know, get some deep experience going. And uh, that's what I'm gonna do with it, pretty much. On my search of uh, discovering the uh, Hisop roots, I pretty much, I know, I know, some of you may tell me this, but uh, I know there's a taxing fee uh, and I'm uh, paying for these. And also, this is nice. Nice. Cooking level 5. Um, that's something else. 
Um, right now, we're just going to use whatever I have been storing because oh, look at that. That's my cooking, all my cooking stuff weigh in around 1.4k. And I'm going to pay a little bit of tax, 151k. Oh, that's going to give us an aptitude crate. That. Um... Is this good? I guess it is. I don't know what to do with the juniper berries. I'm just gonna eat them. There we go. Let's go next, and now we're gonna use the prime scorpion meat. Which I keep getting. Alright, and we're gonna use maybe tar. Let's use that. <coughs> Have a 52% chance. All right, all right. That's all. We're gonna get another one here because I still have more to it. Um, I'm just gonna use pretty much all of my resources here. Um, let's use the go. There we go. From Vampire Survivors, 169. Is that enough? Ah, oh, that's so close. Okay, okay, um, let's use a bit of, uh, do I have any other stuff? So I have that, I have some firm fish fillets, I have more pork, and more garlic. So, do I have anything, um, actually, let me see here, can I use, so I can use garlic, um, I can use rice, I can use apples. I get apples from my root every single time, so just gonna use these. Um, anything else? I don't wanna use the tier 4. I think I should. Oh, I can use these here as well. Oh. Um, I can use milk, I guess. I have a bunch. Let's just do that. Use the apples here and get another. Aptitude. Great. There we have. Very nice. Very nice. I think I could just keep on going really using tomatoes and everything else, but I think that's fine because the main one that I'm probably gonna spam craft this to see if they are about anything, you know, the cooking. Um, and what I do with these, I just, you know, nothing much. Um, now let's open some cooking aptitude uh, chests. Okay, okay. This looks terrible so far. Oh, this looks very bad. Oh my god, this is so bad. Okay, we're not doing cooking anymore, that's for sure. So, I'm glad you guys have seen. What the fuck was that? I got shit. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> that's bad. That's so bad, actually. What the fuck was that? What, what it is doing? What am I supposed to get good out of it? This cauliflowers? I mean, what the fuck? <laughs> that was some bad shit. Oh, I am not doing this shit anymore. Alright, what the fuck? That was so bad. What the actual fuck? <laughs> what the? Like, that's what you get from doing cooking? That's so bad. Okay, never mind. So, as you can see, the knight has showed up. I'm a goblin again. And, uh, yeah, I'm gonna be going for two days. So, I wanted to make this video as an extra one for the day I'm probably gonna miss. And, uh, this just covers up everything pretty much. I am doing a video every single day, by the way. That's why I uh, I set myself as a uh, standard every single day doing a video about uh, New World. 
if I'm doing it here way too much. So <clears throat> I am uh, I want to keep the series going until I reach 300 territories standing on all territories. I don't know if you can get territories standing in Great Cleave. No, you can't. Yeah, that's great. So, three less territories. That would be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Twelve territories. Twelve territories that I need three hundred territory standing. Oh my goodness. Now, we did saw Arcana there doing some magic, and that's probably a really good one. I got like 15 territory standing levels. That's great in my opinion. We much farm his up away. Actually, put Biolers for his up and uh, farm the Ace of Butter. Yeah, but I don't need soul modes. Uh, I mean, soul modes are not that hard to get. There's a route. By the way, there's a root over here. Yeah, you can get a bunch of Somos. There's another root also in Monarch's Bluff around this area. You can just run in circles. That will also reward you with a lot of uh, stuff. But the main thing that I want to do is get the damn armoring, uh, and uh, the precision armoring tools. That's like my main goal, and uh, this is probably the route I'm gonna keep on doing until I get it. Uh, trophy, and I'm very close to it. Um, I only need two more precision ones, and I'm probably gonna buy the armoring journal. I sold one, you know, when when we began the game. I can show you this. Uh, my orders completed and expired, and we sold it out by date. And click again. One of the first things. Oh wait. Oh, this is expired. One of the first thing that I sold. Um, oh, it doesn't remember. Well, oh. so you can only hold it for like one month. But anyways, one thing that we sold was the armored journal. It gave us twenty k to start with. Pretty much ridiculous. Um, yeah, that's that's what I'm missing really. Other than that, I have everything that I need. Yep, yeah, pretty much everything that I need. Um, I also want to check something. Let me see how Arcana. No, Arcana expert. Arcana is, oh, Arcana is master. Okay, so there is. Yeah, apply filter. Okay, so this is uh, what I was talking about. Canis to mastery. Um, is it so? If we go to crafting mods, attribute offensive utility conditional. I think it's a utility, and here we can uh, Skinner's charm. This will yield some the star metal. Uh, can I do this? This one? Recall them? Yeah, the recall one. Oh, so it's only 20 more gold. Okay, that's really assured. Nice. I think I have that one as well. Let's just, uh, let me just check. Okay, nice. Oh, I don't have one. It's the steel one. God damn it. How do you get those? I'm missing some, and I don't know how I'm supposed to be getting them. They're only from a leech uh, chest runs, really. Yeah. Also, I'm really happy with the trophy. Uh, com <laughs> completing, it's like, I'm missing only some of the combat trophies and uh, some fishing ones, two more fishing and that's pretty much it and also look at that, I save 1000, actually you know, like 500 really but yeah, 
and I did like a small uh, wood cutting and uh, iron harvesting and look at this mold, mold generation. This is insane, by the way. The root I use for iron ore also gathers some bolts and some iron wood. It's uh, right here in Onox Bluff, this area. This area, I have just run around here. And there's like iron wood trees right over here near the fast travel in Dead Man's Shrine. And they pretty much run in circles here. It's almost a perfect respawn time. You have to wait like two minutes after you do a couple you will complete a, a rotation, pretty much. Um that's that's it. Yeah, but this is great. This is really great, by the way. Um yeah. That's pretty much it. And yeah, the map looks very balanced. Wow, look at that. Trinity has stuff in here. Everybody has, like, look at that. Only, like, Syndicate is getting trashed. We don't know what the fuck to do in that wars. <laughs> anyways, anyways, anyways. It's, it's a really late. I have to, like, wake up tomorrow. Um, thank you guys very much for watching, and see you guys in the next one. Uh, have a nice one. Bye bye.